a quick breakdown of this ankle pick that I end up hitting. And let's not get it twisted. This man wrecked me large portions of this fight. I'm just highlighting the one thing I did really well. I'll admit that. So, uh, early on in the round, we start off. And what I like to do is to keep people off balance. And sometimes I can ankle pick without an ankle, in a sense, if they're off balance. So, at this stage, I'm testing what his responses are. At this point, I'm hoping that his base isn't quite right and that he can't slide this knee out to compensate for the push that I'm going to get up here. He actually responds really well, but it allows me to set up what I want later down the road. So we're going to get a little deeper into this. Um, I test out this arm drag, and this is what I want here. I want this knee up and that foot down. This knee is going to be completely irrelevant to what I'm trying to do. I throw my feet to the outside. I'm leaning towards the knee that I want, and I'm going to slide my hand just behind his heel and push everything forward. He kind of helps out halfway through. I think he realizes that he's not going to get out of this, and he just kind of goes to guard. Anyways, beautiful work on my behalf.